I guess before I was involved in the farming community, I actually thought farming was nothing to do with me and really quite boring um, and old fashioned or out of date. So, I mean, you know, that's a very judgmental position, but that, that was kind of what I, you know, I thought science and fashion and cities were interesting and exciting and, and farming was boring and disconnected. Um, and it was only through kind of actually starting to farm, my family started to farm ourselves, that I started to realize just how much or how kind of preconditioned I was about what farming was about and how wrong it was, how wrong I was, um, and starting to learn like farming is all about continual innovation and iteration and entrepreneurialism and um, experimenting and learning. Um, and it's particularly in the regenerative farming world. It is so much about that. And so that's where I started to learn this new narrative around farming, essentially. Um, and to recognize just how inspiring and thoughtful farmers are. Um, and, and then the second part of that was when I started to dig holes and I started to see that the soil is alive. And that when you start to understand that the soil is alive, then it's like, whoa. And this world below your feet is actually, you know, in one handful of soil, there are more microbes and living organisms than, um, than there are people on the planet. And then once you understand that world below your feet, it's inconceivable. And that's a whole new opening. And I think that's also a big part of what the new narrative is around regenerative agriculture as well, is just having your mind a bit blown. <laughs>